The debris left behind from a supernova is called the supernova remnant. These remnants can form spectacular nebula, millions of times larger than planetary nebula. The Crab Nebula is a good example. Let's take a closer look at this famous supernova remnant. The remnant is six light years wide and expanding at 1,500 kilometers per second. That's 930 miles per second. The orange filaments are the tattered remains of the star and consist mostly of hydrogen. Japanese and Chinese astronomers recorded this event nearly 1,000 years ago in 1054. It got its name because of its appearance in a drawing made by Irish astronomer William Parsons in 1844. The supernova's remnant neutron star is rotating like a lighthouse. It is ejecting twin beams of radiation that appear to pulse 30 times a second due to the star's extremely fast rotation rate. This kind of neutron star is called a pulsar. This Hubble image captures the region around the pulsar. It is centered on the region around the neutron star, the rightmost of the two bright stars near the center of the image, and the expanding filamentary debris surrounding it. Inside the shell is a blue glow, that is radiation given off by electrons swirling at nearly the speed of light in the powerful magnetic field around the pulsar. Bright wisps are moving outward from the star at half the speed of light to form the expanding ring. It is thought that these wisps originate from a shock wave that turns the high-speed wind from the pulsar into extremely energetic particles.